So there was some news floating around the Economic and Financial Crimes Commission, the EFCC, that they donated a huge sum of 50 billion naira to the Nigerian Education Loan Fund. NEL fund. But the EFCC has come out to clear things up. Yes, they said they didn't actually donate such money. Instead, the 50 billion naira was the money they re had recovered from crimes and had given them back to the government. Yeah. <laughs> now, President Bala Ahmed Tunubu decided to take this recovered loot or this recovered money and use it to fund the student loan scheme. For them, it is part of Tunubu's plan to help the most vulnerable people like students who need financial help. So the idea is that by giving students access to loans, it can help keep them out of trouble and make them focus on their education. They said the EFCC doesn't decide where the recovered money goes, rather it is up to the government to decide that. But they are happy that it is going towards something that can really make a difference for young people. Plus, the EFCC boss Mr. Olao Lukuye added that he and his team will keep an eye on how the 50 billion naira is being used to make sure it is doing what it is supposed to do. And that nobody is messing with it. <laughs> Still on the EFCC, their account, I mean, their Twitter account has mysteriously vanished. And I'm talking about an account of 2.2 million followers. Right now, it is showing the, this account doesn't exist. The EFCC's chief spokesman, Dele Oyewale, says it is just a network problem and their tech team has been trying to fix it for three days, but it is still the same. Let's just hope they find a solution to it. Thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing. I'll catch you in the next video. Peace and blessings. Oh,